to my channel. I've got uh, doing something a little bit different. I found a picture on on Instagram and I wanted to copy the eye look. So this is the eye look and I will put a picture up and you guys can let me know how close I got. I know my wings are way out but I kept trying to get them just right and they just kept growing and growing. <laughs> <coughs> I did uh, my hair and this is about the color that I wanted it the first time I was going pink but I just got a lighter color too light a color but this color I think looks very nice once it washes down a bit I think it'll be very good and of course it stained my nail polish I had green on these fingers and I had like a real pretty uh, coral on the other fingers. <laughs> now they're like a red and red and purple. But hey, they'll work their Easter colors. Anything's Easter colors. So on my face, I just put my uh, Mary Kay uh, CC cream on. This is in the color. Oh, what is it? I think it's just a medium beige, I think is what the color is. Light to medium is what it is. And I picked this up. I had a girl that rode my taxi all the time, and she sold Mary Kay, so I got it off of her. And it's about the right color this time of year for me. It's, um, it's about the right color because, you know, when you're in between spring and and uh, winter, you just don't know what's happening. So of course I use Gourmand Girl Gourmand Girl palettes. Okay, so I went in. I wanted to use the same company. I didn't want to go skip from palette to palette and use different companies. So that's why I use both of the Spectra and the uh, that time of year palette. So I went in with Joy. That's what's all around here. And that was my transition shade, sort of. It didn't go bright enough, so then I had to go into Spectra. Just a minute. So then when I went into Spectra, I went into... Um... Fuchsia. <laughs> I know how, how I'd say it, but it's that, it's this color right here, this bright pink, just to get it a brighter pink. And then in the corner of my, I think that's the only color I used out of there, was that a little bit of the pink. Oh no, I used the lime, the, the uh, sci-fi color, because there's no yellow. So I used uh, the sci-fi color, and it did look fairly yellow. So that's not bad. And then the blue, of course, is frostbite, is what's in what's there. And then I went in with icicle in my very, very corners here. And up on my brow bone, I put snow angel up here. So, yeah, I thought that uh, it looks... It looks not too bad compared to the picture, and I will show you the picture. I'll put it up. And, of course, on my lashes, I just put the false lashes on the top. Um, I was going to put falsies on, but I changed my mind because it's 8.30 p.m., and I'm not staying up till 5 o'clock tonight like I did the other night. <laughs> I stayed up all night Monday night just trying to get that video up on Tuesday so I finally got it done at 5 o'clock in the morning and then my friend came and picked me up at 11 to go do some shopping so I didn't get much sleep so anyways I used uh, the Lash Princess Falsy um, False Lash from Essence and the rim, Rimmel is on the, the brown black color is on the bottom lashes and then I put the uh there's no no uh, color on this, but that's the liner I used. 
It's this one. I usually wear that really nice fuchsia color, but I thought today I'd put this one on. And this is called Hibiscus. And it's a really nice, smooth li um, lipstick from Avon. Put that on your lips. Just feel moisturized immediately. So it's very, very nice. It's one of their better lipsticks. And I put two, two turquoise into my waterline. But I see it's wore off in that one. I got a bad eye today that keeps watering. And I used the white liquid liner from Miss A on my eyes. And like I say, they should be down to about there is where they should be. Would look more li like the photo. But then you got to remember I got old skin. <laughs> old skin. Well, it is old. <laughs> I meant to say, I have a lot more wrinkles on my eyes than that other girl does. So I do have to take my wings up and around my wrinkles to get it up there properly. <laughs> on my old skin. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> Just having my coffee for the evening. My friend came and got me, and we went. I had to go to the bank, and then I had to run to Shoppers uh, Drugstore to get this color. And this is Manic Panic in the color Fuchsia. So hopefully it washes down a little bit, but I don't mind this color at all. I like my hair a little bit darker than lighter, actually. So, yeah. So I was sitting here editing my other movie and waiting for it to download my other video so I thought well I might as well do one one more video so that's what I did so this is for Friday that you'll see this one I hope you enjoy it and give me a rating let me know what you think how close I came to getting the look that she has on her eyes so yeah I will put a picture up of what what her look looks like too. She looks, hers is a lot better groomed, I can tell that. But her eyes aren't as wrinkly as mine. <laughs> she doesn't have old skin yet. <laughs> but her name is, oh I'll have to put her link up. Her name is, uh, I can't say it. I have to, I'll have to put it up because her last name is Cruz, and I found the picture on uh, Instagram last night when I was waiting for a movie to, or for a video to download, so, yeah. So anyways, that's what I thought I'd do. I might do that a little more often. It, it gets me out of my comfort zone and not doing the same look all the time. And I want to be able to do some looks like this, you know. I mean, I would probably never wear this one out of the house. But I like to, if I was sitting around the house and somebody came over, I'd be quite comfortable like this. But in my small little town, if I went out like this, people would just, well, no, they wouldn't to me. They wouldn't look at me that like that because they know I'm kind of strange anyway. <laughs> yeah, they, I get dressed up a lot more than most people do when I go uptown, so. That's just the way I am, and that's the way I've always been. And don't forget, there is a referral link down in the description box for Shop Miss A if you want to do it. Because down in the States, you get a lot cheaper than what when I have to have it shipped up here. But I tried to see if the Dollar Tree did something like that, and then I could have just ordered from... Canada, right, and not had to pay the uh, exchange rate and everything, but no, they don't. If you order from Dollar Tree online, you got to uh, order like um, as if you're selling the stuff online, I guess. And I'm not ready to sell Dollar Tree stuff online. I've got some things that I'm working on that I'm hoping that I'm going to be able to sell a few of them. Uh, they're things that I'm making with my sewing machine, and they're quite useful items, so I will be showing those, and if you would like to order some, then you'll be able to order them. 
Yeah, so anyways, I am going to let you go. I hope you're all having a blessed day, and God be with you.